the channel guys today we're going to be working with the venom balancer stand basically with this one there's two roller bearings and then this is actually going to be turning so this the axle is going to have the rim put inside the cones are going to come in you can put these rollers there there's little for your allen key you can tighten it up so then on both sides so that it doesn't move and then you're going to put this on here i'm going to go through the actual balancing process of it but the most important part of this whole setup is each side has its own little stand that's how you balance it out right then it has a sight glass so you balance this all up and then that'll be right dead center now you know that that's balanced to the ground everything's perfect so let's continue on Okay, so we're going to take this out, slide it in through the axle and the bearing. Okay, that's about centered. One of the most important part of the rim process, of balancing it on that, is the bearing. Make sure that the bearings are good before you put the axle in. Just make sure that it uh, is able to be moved and you can feel like no notches, no kind of hesitation, it goes through. Okay, so you're just going to tighten it up, right? And not, not reefing on it, you're just kind of trying to make sure that it doesn't walk back. Same thing with this side, make sure that it's in. Okay, so in the process of this, you're going to have it on the rod, the bearings are going to help walk it. You spin it a little bit and then that's going to kind of tell you where the heavy spot is. Heavy spot is going to be at the bottom. Okay, so what you're going to do is that's the heavier side. You're going to put weight up at the top, right? We're not going to actually put it on. We're just going to put a full ounce right here. And then we're going to put it right up at the top. So one ounce is up top. We're going to go to a 90 degree. And we're going to let it go. So if it climbs up, that means that I need to put more weight on. If it comes down, it's too much weight. We're gonna add one more. Ninety degrees, and see that it's not moving right now. So it's not moving right now. That means it's balanced. If it went down, then I would have to take one more weight off because you would want less weight than you would actually need. So if it was going to be in balanced either way, less weight is better. Now that we know what we need, we're going to clean that up and put the weight on. We're going to check it. We're going to go to the top. So we're going to pull one off. So that's good. So that's the actual Venom stand. It's actually quite easy to work with. It's pretty decent, pretty accurate as well. Uh, front tire, you really want to have it accurate. Uh, if not, you're gonna have some vibration and stuff. Uh, could have tank slappers too. So if you like the channel, if you like the content, please give me a thumbs up, like, and subscribe. Till next time guys.